that you is activity time, and in our activity lesson today, we going to learn about hairs. Do you know that our fingerprint is different, and our hair color is also different? Um, God made my hair very special, as special as my fingerprint. Okay, let's read some vocabulary. Straight, curly. Follicle and muscle. Do you know that roots, uh, the roots push the hair to make it grow longer. By now, my hair is very thick. Can you see that? It's really thick. Do you know that all hairs grow from the roots? We talk about that in a little bit, but I'm so excited that we're going to learn about hairs. Um. That do you know that God knows the exact number of our hair? Um, the number are over one hundred thousand. That was a really big number, and uh, my hair is thick and straight. Do you know that some hair has the same color? They have the same color, but they are different. Because some hair is straight, some hair is fine, some hair is curly, and some hair is thick. Um, do you know that the roots are below the skin? Yes, the roots are below the skin, and and blood vessel. The blood vessel has oxygen. Oxygen. And they brought oxygen to the roots. And they brought oxygen to the root, and then the root push up the hair to make the hair grow longer. Okay, let's read. Let's read the vocabulary again. Straight, curly, follicle, and muscle. My hair special to me. God made my hair just as special as my fingerprint. No one else has hair quite like mine. Some hair is straight. By now, my hair is straight and is a little bit curly. My hair is thick. Some hair is thick. Some hair is curly. Some hair is fine. Uh. Do you know that my mom's hair is fine? She has very soft hair, and my little sister' hair is short. Do you know that we going to go to the? We might cut our hair because when we hurt sometimes in the body, the hurt will bring it to the hair, and we need to cut our hair. And let's read some more. My hair grows, or hair grows out of the skin from roots. The roots are below the skin. The blood brings food to the hair root to help the hair grow. When my hair grows, the roots push the hair up to make it longer. Um. Not only us have hair, but animals do have hair. Just like dog, zebra, cat, and a lot of animals. Yes. So we, so animals do have hair. Animals do have hair too, and we have hair. By now, can you see my hair is very? My hair is growing longer because the roots, the roots push up my hair. And then the blood brings food to help my hair grows. So let's read: hair, skin, oil gland, follicle, muscle, root, and blood vessel. Let's turn to the next page. Do you know a pigment? A pigment gives our hair color. I have a pigment, and you see my hair color is black. Um. Oh, my family has the color hair is black. Some people has yellow hair, red hair, brown hair, and black hair. Black hair are just like mine. So let's read some vocabulary. Color.
thousand numbered pigment. Okay, let's read it again. Pigments give our hair color. Say that with me. Pigments give our hair color. Now it's your turn. Oh, good job. Um, the color of my hair. Every hair has pigment. There are many pigments. Oh, let's pause there. Um, do you know that God knows the number of our hair? He gave us hair and then he knows the exact number. There are many pigments. Black, brown, red, or yellow. That's why my hair is the color that it is. Something to do. Color is child hair. And student watching, in a moment, you and your on-site teacher going going to color the child hair. Mm, but do you know that something I can't remember? I can't remember much, but... Hmm. Do you know do you know that a pigment mean pigment gives our hair colors and pigments have some color just like black, yellow, red, brown and red. It's so fun learning about hair, but let's read some more. How many hairs do I have? Hmm. Uh, when I finish telling you about hair, I finish telling you about hair, and I sit down on, I sit down on, um, what is it? Hmm. I sit down on my chair, and I began to count my hair. Ah, it's, it's really difficult to count our hair. Do you know that almost everyone has over 100,000 hairs on his head? Do you know that our God is so great that he knows the exact numbers of hair we have? No one knows that but God. The Bible said, but the very hair of your head are all numbered. Matthew 10 through 30. It's so fun learning about hair and hmm. Remember some hair is thick, some sometimes hair is straight, sometimes hair is thick, sometimes hair is short or long, and sometimes hair is curly or some hair is fine. And remember all about the hairs and bye. See you next time. Have a great Fun day.